Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever the fluff you are. Might as well do this one while I'm walking in the sun. Rather than me sat down in one spot, I'll do it while I'm walking around since I've got the chance to. This is going to be another little rambling catch up. Uh, I'm just going to get it straight off the bat. I don't think there's going to be much more in the way of um, up the ticks or even bleeding cherry and white for a little while because I don't know whether I can actually afford it until I get a job. The job that I was going for I didn't get so that's um, pushed the finances a little more. Uh, one of the reasons why I'm out here is just because it's a nice day. Uh, I had a tenner spare in my pocket I could do. Uh, plus some of the birthday money came in from a couple of family members because it was my birthday earlier in the month so some of the family members that uh, rely on when they get paid close to the end of the month just came through all with my doll as well but you know I ain't exactly going to say that but yeah whatever but just thought why not since I'm here uh, even though I know it is going to be the last home game of the season tomorrow for Attics plus uh, unless a miracle happens, have a look in the bank and there's enough dollars to be able to afford that and some beers, I don't know. Yeah, I can always forego the beers, but still, 25 quid sometimes, especially if you're doing it three or four times a month, does drag on a bit, you know. That's when you don't exactly have it. But, you know, that's life, that's life. Uh, as for the rugby, again, it's within it's same thing unless they do any massive deals on tickets. I don't know whether I'm going to be able to do that and I'm getting blinded out by the way so I don't mention that uh, but you know just the way it is for that uh, but the rest of it I don't know it might be more like, gaming stuff I know I'm trying to do a lot more on Twitch so I might end up doing like an advert for Twitch and just going hey join me on Twitch guys blah, 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 blah. like every bugger else does you know or I might just ignore doing the the ad void and go elsewhere but you never know you never know but this is definitely a different bit yeah you can see the manchester central library behind me and there's the town hall and all this gothic glory which at the moment yes is wrapped up because they're doing some restoration work on it so obviously the city center's going to be doing that yeah, as you probably would have seen about, but I don't know, depends on whenever this thing goes up, but a few hours ago, definitely, a few hours ago, because this one ain't going up straight off my phone, um, this one will have a little bit more to do with the beginnings and stuff, but yeah, you would have seen that I did a five guys, five guys taste test, uh, after I've sat for a little while, and that must have been cover from having all of that food stuffed into there, um, my review would be, yes, it is good, but it does come with a fat butt there, um, but just the, yeah, the cost. Like I said in that mini vlog, the cost. Also, there's one thing I did forget to put in there as well, is uh, if you do have an allergy to nuts, don't go to Five Guys because they do use nut oil. So, uh, that's one thing I did uh, forget to do, is just mentioned that they do use, I think it's peanut oil or something like that it might even be canola oil, I don't know but it's some form of nut that they have in their oils uh, so there's that for everything else, apart from job hunting and stuff like that I uh, don't know, there's, at some point there is going to be a um, a weird video that I'm going to do it's possibly chasing up the missing history or the lost history of uh, Westwood Power Station since it's around the corner from where I now live I'll have a look at that, since that might be uh, worth a little uh, try, we'll see if I can bosh that. This is a cold, so the wind is going to be there, plus just beyond these corners as well, it's quite a wide open square, so it does get a wee bit windy down here, but hey, it's obviously going to be the same. So, uh, see if I can give you a sneaky view. If I just quickly look through the boat, see if I can give you a quick sneaky look at what. See, behind all of that lot, behind all that scaff, over there, there's the tower of that, the Tower of Doom. 
when it bombs it does sound quite uh, quite foreboding but well, you can just about see some of the stuff in its splendour over there yeah. obviously it does need a lot of work on it because uh, it is a very old back from pieces of Victorian history the video will just give you a quick spin around yeah and then you can see what I think that's the um, uh, over there Millers is somewhere around here as well, but I'm not going to Millers on sort of random walkie walks while I get any chance to. There's little side alleys and everything, just like down there. Side alleys and all the history of the, the city and everything. And, you know, like all of this is literally five minutes away from the main, like the main area. So if I walk down here, I'll see where we've got one of the shopping malls. I'm going to walk down this way, which I'm going to do, actually, get some of the history in. Might as well do it while I'm down here, but I know I'm not rambling, this has turned into a random ramble. But I don't know. Health wise, yes, uh, this was as it's supposed to be. Well, I was going to do this one a few days ago. As, uh, yes, the rugs, they do work. Yes, the hormone therapy is working. There is happenings. All I'm going to say, there is happenings. But other than that, I don't really know what else to say. And yes, I know after the last time you saw the, the vlog type thing, that was created by so was in Manchester. Yes, that was. I am not doing very well. Well, now I am doing a little bit better. He is well out of the hospital and he's well, 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 well on his way to total recovery. I don't know, to some of you Americans that do watch this, I am technically legally jaywalking. You can do that here. you just got to watch out for the traffic. But, but it is fun though. Wandering around a city which is at least 2,000 years old. I guess we do have some Roman ruins somewhere in the city. Actually, I'm heading down towards Castlefield, so that's where the Roman remains are, the Roman rock. Part of the old fort of Mamusium. The fort on the breast shaped hill. Mamusium, Mam, Mamories. Yeah, if uh, you had to take the N and take it one phrase forward, it's Manchester. So, yeah, but. Ooh, just so you can see a little bit of history, which is possibly gone. But, this has just become another random ramble whilst I get lost whilst I wander around the city centre. Why not? As long as you head towards a main road, a tram line, a river, or a train line, you'll always find your way around the centre. Hey, and here we are. Now, some of you might remember, well, you probably won't remember this, but part of this place did into Hogwarts. Some of the interior of this place as well was uh, turned inside and used as part of the grand staircase. I think it might have been, don't know if it was Gryffindor, whether it was Hufflepuff, but one of them had one of these finial corners as their staircase. It's really weird because that is uh, the Ryland's library. And then if you look right there, got a bank. History. All over the city centre. But yeah, this is what you'll find anywhere around a lot of British cities. You've even got stuff like this all over. You know? See, that just gives you an even better view of it, but yeah. I wouldn't mind going in Rylands, but sometimes I don't want to. I don't want to disturb people by going in. No. Looks like New York, this place never sleeps. Forever evolving, forever changing. And I will leave you guys with a view of Rylands.